Hello there, Stuart Elford here, Chief Executive of Devon and Plymouth Chamber of Commerce with my usual weekly update. And I can't believe another week has literally zoomed by. Uh, probably like me, you're all going a bit square-eyed from endless video calls. Now looking forward to a time when we can meet in person and shake hands. And on that subject, our events are moving more from uh, looking at our lobbying activities and our um, financial support packages and so forth into the more practical return to work aspects. And in fact, uh, we've got, uh, got another in our series with Womble Bond Dickinson um, in the return to work on the 2nd of July. So look out for that with details below. Prior to that, on uh, Monday 29th, our Chamber Live is with Paul Coles from BT looking at the rollout of super fast broadband and, and uh, 5G, uh, the very things business needs at this t particularly at this time with us all working from home and remotely uh, to be very well connected uh, in the southwest. And I think this is something that can position the southwest very well as people realise that we don't need to work in, in busy cities. Uh, the southwest has a lot to offer in terms of cost effective premises and staff, fantastic quality of life, skilled people, uh, uh, and good connectivity. So that'll be a really fascinating event, and uh, look out for that too. Um, future events will include things like. Um, looking at creating and editing simple video content, which is, uh, we'll all have realised, much as I am now, that this is becoming uh, more and more the norm. Uh, so I hope you will find that uh, useful. Uh, I see that governments are talking about easing uh, uh, the restrictions in, in the two metre distancing to one metre, as they call it, one metre plus. Uh, and I know there are some costs for business where you have uh, separated to two metres, but I think where you can, that's still sensible. I think it's uh, uh, incumbent on all of us uh, to do the right thing uh, in trying to keep our staff and customers as safe as possible. So if you still can distance to two metres, uh, do. And the one metre is really to help those industries uh, that can't. So uh, the last couple of things I have to tell you about. One is there are still opportunities to sponsor and provide content for our small business toolkit. Look out for details of that in the newsletter. Uh, this is going to be a fantastic toolkit with a whole range of subjects to help uh, our business members and a chance to put your brand in front of all those members. So, so look out for details uh, below. And hopefully now Profile Magazine should have hit your, your desks. Uh, and I hope you like the content, which is largely, help, uh, as you would imagine, around coronavirus, returning to work and all those subjects, sharing good stories. Um, the next edition of Profile will be produced locally, and we'll give you more details for that uh, as we've taken on a, a new relationship with new publishers. So uh, you won't hear from me next week, hopefully, because I'm off to move house and taking a, a week off to do that, uh, if we can ever get the uh, contract over the line. Uh, but Helen will no doubt keep you updated. Uh, in the meantime, uh, stay safe and thanks for your continued support.